Good evening, everyone, and Merry Christmas Eve to all of you out there. This is Ben back again, and now it's time for a celebrity movie collection video since I did plan it out uh, earlier today, in which for this uh, celebrity movie collection video that I'm going to be showing you guys, um, and also a really quick thing is that this is also my very first celebrity movie collection video that I'm filming with my new iPhone 13, which, of course, I'm filming with the phone light, and you may notice that it's a lot brighter than the than any of the other ones that I filmed with, much like the comparison videos. So, yeah, that's definitely a big difference. But, um, and also the sound as well. But anyways, for this video, I'm going to be showing, for the Celebrity Movie Collection video, I'm going to be showing you guys my Anthony Hopkins movies, which I have some, not a lot, but I do have some. So, um, of course, they're all on videotape, by the way. I do have one of his films or no, two of his films I have on DVD, but I'm not going to show those because I'm only showing the videotapes, so. But anyways, let's get right into it. First up, we have The Silence of the Lambs. This is from 1991. This is also with Jodie Foster and Scott Glenn. Yep, no critic review on this, on this one, on this tape, but still pretty good. Yep, it's another one of the most famous movies of all time, as you guys know. And yeah, this this definitely improvement because of the lighting and the on the cover and even on the tape itself, which is pretty nice. And there is no printing on the tape, by the way. Anyways, we're going on. We have the remains of the day. This is also with Emma Thompson. This is a James Ivory film. Um, over seventy top ten lists for best picture of the year by those reviews, which I'm not going to read and. Pat Collins at WWR TV calls this film absolutely perfect. You won't see a better movie this year. Yep. Oh, and uh, Christopher Reeve is in this film, the original Superman film, so I'll definitely have to check it out. And by the way, I'm not going to show the tape on this because um, I move it's like this when I got it, but the sticker is not cut in half, so I I'm not going to show, so I can't show the tape, but that's okay. But anyways, going on. We have Amistad. This is also with Morgan Freeman, Jamon Hoso, and Matthew McConaughey. Absolutely Unforgettable by, by Jeffrey Lyons of WNBC TV. This is a Steven Spielberg movie. Amistad is a superlative achievement by Gene Shalit today. Yep. You got the label, and the print date is October 18th, 2000. Next up, we have The Mask of Zorro. This is also with Antonio Banderas and Catherine Zeta-Jones, Stuart, Stuart Wilson, and Matthew Letcher. Great um, great fun, I love it, by Jill Seale, Good Morning America. And I can't read the other review because um, part of it, as you know, is covered up by the Blockbuster sticker, so I'm just going to forget it. Got the label. Yep, the former Blockbuster rental. You can tell because the stickers. Here's Meet Joe Black. This is also with Brad Pitt. What Great Movies Are All About by Larry King of USA Today. It's a two-tape set. This movie is incredible by Larry King of USA Today. Yep, we got part one and part two. This, this is also a blockbuster rental as well. Next up, we have Instinct. This is also with Cuba Gooding Jr., Powerful by w, WBAI Radio. Gripping by NBC TV Chicago. Terrific by NBC TV Chicago. Wait. Oh no, it's the... I thought it was the same review as on the front, but it's... by the, It's a different review, but it's the same reviewer. Anthony Hopkins gives another riveting performance by WPIX TV. We got the label, and print date is January 5th, 2000. Printed just five days after the new year. We got Mission Impossible 2. This He makes an appearance in this. That's why I'm showing it. Tom Cruise sidles in a blast of thrills and suspense by Peter Charles of Rolling Stone. It's exhilarating. MI2 is a pure kinetic adventure. Thumbs up by Roger Ebert, Ebert, Ebert at the movies. And Put Your Mind on Cruise Control and Fasten Your Seatbelt by Jill Siegel, Good Morning America. Sequel to Mission Impossible, and I did show this when I did my Tom Cruise movies earlier this month, so, yep. Okay, we got two more left. Here's How the Grinch Stole Christmas. This is the Jim Carrey film. 
which I showed in my Jim Carrey movies uh, last week, I think. Yeah, beginning of last week. An instant classic by J. Carr, The Boston Globe, and Steve Murray of Atlanta Journal-Constitution calls this film that can make your heart grow three sizes if you're not laughing too hard. I, I, I don't think I... Reve I no, I don't think I read the review on that on when I showed my Jim Carrey movies. And Philip Wunsch of Dallas Morning News calls some a holiday package that kids will embrace and parents will adore. Yep. This is a former family video rental. We got the label and no print date. And finally, we have Hannibal. This is from 2001. This is a Ridley Scott film. This is also a Julianne Moore who uh, takes over the role of uh, from Jodie Foster as Clara Starling. And can't read the review because of the sticker, but that's all right. This is another former rental. Got the label and the blockbuster <laughs> sticker. Okay, so that is it for my Anthony Hopkins movie collection video. And I will see you again uh, actually tomorrow because since tomorrow is Christmas Day, I, got, I am planning to get some, get a few movies like on VHS, DVD, Blu-ray, and 4K respectively. And so... Because of that, I will be doing, uh, and also some other items as well, but because of that, I'm going to be doing a movie update for you tomorrow morning uh, after I get them. So stay tuned. Uh, so stay tuned for tomorrow when I do that.